We do a big survey every year, 25,000 donors throughout North America. And the purpose of that survey is just to get the lay of the land and ask them, what are you thinking about your philanthropy? And how do you plan to give over the next 12 months? It's really helpful for fundraisers because it's the only research study that we're aware of that actually looks ahead so that they can use that information for planning. And normally we just do one a year, but we saw the economy turning south once again at the end of August and having had a really positive result in the 2011 Cygnus donor survey where more than 75% of the donors we interviewed said they give at least the same if not more than they gave last year. Things were looking pretty bright after two or three years of you know, not much fun in the fundraising business. And uh, so we were very eager to uh, publish those happy results and we saw uh, fundraisers raising a little more and a little more and feeling more confident than they had in the last two years. And then wham went the economy at the end of August. So uh, for the first time ever we've injected a supplementary survey that we ran mid-September to late September and we caught as a matter of fact, the, what, the big downturn on September 22nd in the market. Mm -hmm. So we interviewed people before and after that downturn. And even a single day when the market dropped changed donors' thinking and behavior towards their philanthropy. But the overall result is that donors seem to have returned to the very cautious approach they were taking in February 2009, which was sort of our worst ever result for this annual study. Now there is some hope on the upside. First of all, the fact that we're running this research in September means donors have been giving already throughout the year. So when the majority now says they're getting very cautious, um, a large proportion of the major donors plan to give less now than they gave last year, um, it is uh, October already. So what they're saying is for the balance of the year, even though I'm well aware that uh, not-for-profits raise more money between October and December than they raise the rest of the year. Uh, when it comes to major donors, they've likely been giving throughout the year already, and so their negative outlook may be mitigated somewhat by the more positive uh, feeling and performance in fundraising they were exhibiting earlier this year.